Hey world, it's Kelly Jones here again. I'm going to tell you about the most trippiest thing right now. <clears throat> All right, so <clears throat> I've just um, I've just read a chapter in um, one of um, David Icke's books and um, jumped online to confirm the information. <laughs> this is so trippy and great. Okay, so <clears throat> um, apparently what's going to happen come 2012 with the reptilian agenda and how they're going to use the experience of 2012 and all this religious tension they've created in the world and all this um this fully co um conflicting energy they've created in people of different religious dominations is it come 2012 they now bearing in mind that they um are 50 years ahead of us in technology so what we have today in this world is actually 50 years behind what they have and this has been confirmed by all the people who've been interviewed um, from the mind control programs and who've been on the inside and, and been part of the the research teams who have come out and stepped up for what they believe to be true um <clears throat> right so come 2012 the plan is and this has been confirmed that the reptilian agenda is going to stage a fake holographic light show in the air systematically around every country in the world um, and project the Messiah. The Messiah, the, the, um, <clears throat> in relation to whatever domination they're, they're ahead of. So it would be like the Christian Messiah, there'll be, the, there'll be Buddha, there'll be Allah, the Muhammad, there'll be all of the gods, the gods of these prison religions, holographically beamed into the sky um, and speaking to the people about one world religion and the religion that the agenda wants them to follow. And <laughs> if that's not fucking kooky enough, <clears throat> what's kooky is that if we don't get this out, people are actually going to believe it's true. That's what's kooky. So I'm going to start talking about this right now. Um, what's kookier is that then they're going to stage a fake holographic UFO attack and the Messiah is going to save us all from the UFO invasion. And then they're all, all the different Messiahs are going to come, become one Messiah and form this idea of one God, one world nation, one world central controlled religion. <clears throat> That's trippy, hey? Now, I haven't um, received any channel information about this or I haven't um, actually done much research, but I just, as soon as I read it, I was like, that's going to happen. I just knew it. I know it to be true. Um, <clears throat> so I'm letting you know and start talking about this and the more, <laughs> because once I know that it's true, the information usually comes through in different ways to me and um, then we get, start getting some confirmation here in the office. But I've got my whole team on this one because this one is fantastic. Now, if, if um, the world knows that this is their plan, it's that they can't really do it, can they? Because then, <clears throat> then everyone, most people look at it and go, oh my God, that's a load of shit. That's exactly what they were talking about four years ago, and um, it won't have the same impact. But of course, as we know in this world, there's so many religious fanatics out there right now. There's so many people um, acting crazy in the name of religion. And <clears throat> so desperate, and this whole Armageddon, this whole Armageddon thing coming up is really going to affect um, the sovereignty of, of a lot of people. So just to start getting it out there, starting you guys <laughs> talk about it and think about it. Um, <clears throat> 2012, the reptilian agenda are going to stage a fake holographic light show and um, project the Messiah into the sky, who is then going to fight with a group of projected UFO invasion and save us all from their attack. <laughs> you heard it first here on live, <laughs> live on YouTube. <laughs> yep. Uh, do, you, do your research, hey, because I know this is true, so you guys figure it out for yourselves. 